Well, it's that time of year, the year again. I'm, I'm, I'm going to start that bit again now. Well, it's that time of the year again where players' contracts end in five months. I want to extend them, but there's a problem. All the players want at least double their wages, which financially is not possible. So a rebuild is definitely incoming. <laughs> Hello and welcome to Club One, part 5 of the Globe Explorer. And in today's episode, we shall be playing our Panorama South games against Truro City and Eastbourne Borough. So since the last episode, we've played quite a lot of pictures. I, mean, I think we've played like a dozen, or maybe just under that. So we've lost twice. No, no, actually, no. The over was in the last episode. So we've lost twice since the last episode, and that was against Hamilton Waterloo Waterlooville. And Tom Bridge Angels, just narrow defeats. Apart from that, our form has been very good. We are through to the fourth, third round. No, so yeah, fourth round of the FA Trophy. We've got a fourth round tie against Southport, so it should be beating them quite easily. I'm not bothered about the FA Trophy so much. If we get to the final, that's the only game I will show you. I'll show you the semi final, depending on who it's against. Apart from that, league wise, very good. Picked up four wins, and that was a win against Dartford, Chelmsford, Hemel Hempstead, and uh, Truro City. So that does leave us fifth in the table, 43 points from 25 games. We're 11 points off Chelmsford. I don't think we're going to finish top of the league this year, but I'm sure we will finish in the playoffs. But we uh, haven't said that, we are only three points above Tom Bridge, who are in eighth, so... It's going to be tight. We have done a little bit of transfer business. Jack McLaughlin has gone out to Gondomar for, on, for the rest of on loan for the rest of the season. We are not going to extend his contract because he can't get work permit. So what's the point then? Sean Dunedin has joined Drogheda United for 3.1k, potentially rising up to 3.4k. So that's, that's just another player off our wage bill. Mm -hmm. No players coming in yet. Might try and get a couple of players in before the, our next game, but I don't think that's going to be possible. We're, all of our players are out of contract. I want to. I do really want to like offer contracts to Jarvis, Lapsley, and Collins, but they, they just don't. They just don't want to discuss because they want two superly high wages. So, yeah. But I think. Um, I reckon we're going to at least sign 20 players next year. So the lineup for our match against Truer will be Ombang in goal, a back four, Crow, Marshall, Moxie and Myers, Lapsley and Hall in the midfield. They've got Francis on the right, Endicott on the left, and a strike force of Collins and Jarvis. Come on, let's get a win. We've literally just beaten Truro City, like fairly... I don't know barely a week ago, it might have been like three or four days ago, so it should be a nice, easy win. You know, you like to think, but football manager has a mind of its own sometimes. All right, come on, lads. Let's try and get an earliest goal. Johnson is through for... Nah, that's a pretty... Well, you've got to be better defended than that. Can't give the ball straight back to them. Thankfully, they um, didn't really take their chance. That's uh, that's all right. Uh, they've got a throwing. They are going to try and do a long throw. I don't think it's going to work. It does work. Finley Johnson has opened the score to make it 1-0 with 20 minutes on the clock. That is not good news. <laughs> Come on, lads. Let's try and get an equaliser before half-time, please. Endicott is looking... A bit tired, so we will monitor him in the second half. I would like to do I yeah, Stubbs is Stubbs is on the bench. I forgot to take off the goalkeeper. How silly of me. Alright, come on lads. Couple of minutes left. Are we gonna get an equalizer? We've had nine shots, two on target, whereas Truro have only had two shots, one on target. I I don't really I don't really get that. I feel like we're, we're being FM'd, I think. Is that is that a phrase, FM'd? Or am I just making that one up? 
cool. Come on, can we just clear this one? Somebody clear it. Come on, just get it out. Well, Lapsy, it's a good block. Come on, get into him again. Oh, ah, oh, very, very close chance with True, eh? but thankfully they, they did just narrowly miss the goal. Right, well, I think we are going to make some subs. Endicott is going to come off for Jack Stobbs. He can be a inside forward. Hmm, who else? Ace Hall is going to come off for Ryan Hansen. And who do we have on the bench? We've got Trumpeter, who's a very good young striker. He's already played a couple of games this season. And Ollie Tomlinson. Hmm, I, I think we'll leave the third change for now. I probably will get on Trumpeter for the last 10 minutes, see if he can make an impact. I very much shout it because he is still young. He's like only 17, but he's got good potential. Come on. Are we going to get another goal? Or just a goal? Jarvis mm. is going to make way for Trumpeter. Hopefully he can bang us in a goal or two. Well, we're going to drop some encouragement with the 15 minutes we have left, just in the hope we can find an equaliser. I don't think we're going to win the match, but we might. Stops. Place it through to Trumpeter. He threw a goal. My God. Imagine if he scored. He would have been like the super sub. Crow whips in the corner. That's not a bad delivery. Moxie. Back to Crow. Crow tries to get back post, but it is headed out. Come on, lads. Come on, let's get a goal from this attack. Please. Trumpet here. Crow, come on. Let's get the ball into the box. Francis, now you cross it. You're good at crossing. Collins. Can't get the ball out of his feet. And now Lapsley has made a foul. <sighs> I'm, I'm not sure how we haven't had an equaliser yet. We've come so close on so many occasions, but it... We just haven't, we haven't been clinical enough. But hopefully there might still be another attack. Moxie, Francis, come on. That's not a bad ball. Stops. Go on. Myers, Hanson, Crow, shoot. Oh my God, how is, how is that not a goal? How did we not get a goal from that opportunity? We do have a throwing though. Trump's here, stops. Whips in, Francis is there. It's a corner. It's a corner. Come on, lads. Make this one count. Moxie whips in the corner. Eventually. Come on. Marshall. Goes down the box and it's... Yeah, it's a penalty. Oh, I hope Marshall's not... His injury isn't too serious. I will try and get another centre-back just to replace Dunedin. Moxie puts it into the top right-hand corner. Is there time for a second goal? I think there is. How much How much other time are we going to get, Mr. Fourth Official? Five. You never know. I don't think we're going to get any more highlights. No, but, um, it does end in a one or draw. I think we've been slightly FM'd. We should have won that. But, yeah, I'll take a draw. Are we still, if we're still in the playoff places, I think that, that's fine. Right. That's fine. We're still in the playoff places. That's all that matters. Uh, said sister. So hopefully, let's just forget about that draw. Let's hope we get back to winning race with a win against Eastbourne. The lineup of match against Eastbourne will be on banging goal, a back four, Crow, Marshall, Moxie and Myers, Lapsy and Hall in the midfield. Then we've got Francis on the right, Endicott on the left. Then, once again, the strike force of Jarvis and college i did notice we had a player wanted in the squad i, can't, I couldn't see who but i presume i presume it's the lapsley yes it is he's wanted by Bert Burton. if he can go for at least 40k that will give us a lot of transfer budget which we will probably end up moving into wage budget because let's face it we're found around the south we're not going to spend money on players because they'll want, if we do end up spending money on players, they'll want, they'll want stupidly high wages, which, quite frankly, we don't have. Marshall, Lapsley, come on, let's get the ball in the box. Let's grab an early goal. Moxie, Jarvis, 
thought that was the goalkeeper for a second. It's the referee. End of court. Jarvis puts the ball into the back of the net for his 27th goal of the season. I mean, I'm sure he will. I'm sure Jarvis will get some offers in for him in January. I'm sure we will. I, can't, I don't see why no one would want him, not even if like, they're in League 2 or top end of Panorama National, because he's an absolute brilliant striker. Still only 25, so still quite young. Still got a long career ahead of him. Come on, lads. 2-0 before half-time. Is that too much to ask? We do move up into fourth with that goal. That's pretty good. I'm not sure how many points off top now we are. Marshall. Lapsley, come on. This could be another opportunity to get a second goal. Myers, come on. Moxie, Marshall, passing the ball around the back. Crow, come on, cross it. Oh no, Endicott's injured. I hope it's not too serious, but it doesn't matter because Jarvis has got his second goal of the day. Oh yeah. Stobbs can come on. Well, I'm, I hope it's not too serious. If it's like, if he's out for at least four or five months, I'll just, I'll terminate his own and get another left winger. I'll probably just try and sign another left winger anyway, on, like or on loan or permanent. I really don't know. Come on. Ten minutes left of the first uh, stops. It's, uh, I mean, just about goes in. It does come off the post and... Uh, as it is now 3-0 to Torquay with 10 minutes left to play of the first half. We have looked very good this uh, half. So, oh, can we get one more goal? Moxie with a de decent effort. I'm not sure if he is the best. I don't think I've seen him score free kick yet this season. He might have, but I just can't remember if he has. Come on, can we get this one cleared? Can we get a tackle in or block? Barry, that's not Gareth Barry playing for East C. It's an East Ball, is it? I don't think it is. Is it? No, it's not. Bradley Barry. I don't think they're related. They, they might be half inside. I, I don't think they are. Come on, lads. 45 minutes left. This be an absolute huge victory for us. A win here. Five points clear of eight which will do us the world of good with 19 games left of the season can Jarvis get his hat trick I'm I'm sure Jarvis is going to get a hat trick this game I'm positive come on right we are going to make a couple of substitutions Myers is looking tired hmm <clears throat> we'll get on Ollie Tom actually no yeah Ollie Tomlin so they will just move Moxie out onto the left and I think, I said, you know what, I think we're gonna, we're gonna leave the final change for now, because we've already made one or two. So, we'll leave the third one for now, just in case we do get any more injuries, which we don't want that to happen. Can we get this one clear? Corbett, Kai Corbett, the former West Ham player, does get, get a goal back for Eastbourne. Let's hopefully, hopefully they don't make a comeback. I don't think they will. Because that's, that's the first decent thing they've done all game. Corbett, please don't. Well done, Stobbs. I generally thought they were actually going to go on and get a second. But thankfully, Stobbs is there to save the day. On bang. Whips upfield. That's not a bad header from uh, Jarvis. Stobbs has the chance to cross it. Goes back to Moxie. Jarvis is there through his hat trick. I believe that's his... Is that his first hat trick this season? I, th I think it might be, but I'm, it probably is not. It might be. I, I don't know how many goals he scored. <laughs> I reckon he'll, if he stays with us till the end of the season, I reckon he'll get at least 40. 50 might be pushing it, but I reckon he'll, he'll get at least 40. You know what? A couple of minutes left. We are going to make our final change. I think we're going to get on. We're going to get off Lapsley for Hansen. Why not? Give him a run out. I've been left. I don't think Eastbourne are going to score three goals. And there goes the full-time whistle. And it does end in a 
4-1 victory for the mighty, I don't even know what our nickname is, uh, I think it's the goals, the, like the seagulls, I don't know. Oh, fan day was it? I think I didn't know that was a fan day. What do I do? When does the season end? It seems point. Can we? So we can't even terminate the loan. So we're just going to have to keep him here and not play him because by the time he's fit. The season will have ended. He might be fit in time for the playoffs. I, I fairly doubt it, but we'll speak to him. Don't worry about your injury. You'll... I guess that's another position we need to sign. Well done, Jarvis. You, you are absolutely amazing. Shall we try and offer you a contract? No. No, we'll, we'll try and get nearer the end of the season if he's still here. Had a roaring success. Right, so how many points off top are we? 12 points. Okay. I don't think we're going to finish top. We might do. Still got like 20 games left of the season, so never say never. So I think I'm probably just going to come round. I'd like the halfway point of this uh, run of games. So I think in the next episode, we are going to be playing against Avery and Weymouth. If you have enjoyed today's video, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel for more Dental Football Manager videos, and thank you very much for watching!